Steam ahead who's pulled little Garth out of the saddle back on the inside the big guy on his outside then is on the ropes Black Magic Miss Hardridden coming into the turn he's got civil rights out even wider now and they're followed by Galaxy Prince down near the inside with Red Blast trying to thread his way through but getting held up behind a bit of traffic down to ball the leader from on the ropes full steam ahead Galaxy Prince getting through a needle eye opening Terra Force tracking it through Red Blast into the clear as well Red Blast on the ropes full steam ahead under the big weight coming now Galaxy Prince Prince on the inside, Galaxy Prince full steam ahead, but it's Galaxy Prince right up against the Dulux. Galaxy Prince gets in, squeezed home. Bob, congratulations on the victory. Great way to start the day, and uh, so you would have been impressed with the ride from Lucy. Yes, she rode him well. She got back a little bit further than what we expected, and uh, if the gap hadn't have come, we'd have been in a little bit of trouble because it looked like she couldn't get out. In trouble, that's for sure. It looks as though he's come back in, in good style. The first up run had a lot of merit behind Trade Down. Yes, I was a bit disappointed in his first up run and um, I said to Alana before the race that uh, everything's in his favour today, being a dead four, which uh, we don't get here very often, it obviously suits them, it suits them more than Reddy's and um, she had uh, three kilos off his back as well, so I just thought everything was in his favour today to win. It's a massive help when we go back to his uh, previous campaign, I suppose once we get to Ascot then uh, we're not on tracks like this and just with what you're saying, he obviously prefers this thing out of the ground. Well, I think so, because uh, early on we thought he was a really good horse. In fact, at one time I thought he was our best horse, and uh, he hasn't, sh hasn't given it to us. So maybe it is Ascot that does it. Speaking of good types, Antique Bell resumes. She looked to have a, a realistic chance uh, in the race that was unfortunately uh, scrapped on the head last week due to the bad weather with Smoko. Uh, she's first up today after a long absence. What can we expect? Oh, it's only a thousand metres and um, there's a horse called That'll Do in it that I think will be somewhere up near the lead and will scoot away on the corner and uh, then it's a matter of how good she is, whether she can run them down, but uh, it's a lot to expect after 17 months off. It is a big ask, especially with that barrier 14. She's drawn exceptionally wide. Last week she had a kind barrier. Yes, uh, I don't think the thousand metres worry that much with the barrier because you've got a straight run to the corner and um, it'll work all right. Highly secret later on in the day. Could not have been more impressive in maiden company, but obviously it's a rising grade. Yes, well, she's going to tell us today whether, how good she is. She's also got a nice alley. Yeah, <laughs> we got 14 out of 14 with both. <laughs> Great start to the day. Congratulations on the victory. Thank you. Bob Peters and uh, Galaxy Prince successful taking out the Tab Touch Your Industry, Your TAB Handicap with Lucy Warwick aboard.